I think of this dungeon, just the enemies in general are just kind of like, all right. Especially when you're wanting to like rush through, just get through the normal enemies so you can get to the cool boss, which by the way, this dungeon does even have a boss. I mean, it's, it sort of does, but then the boss is just like, hey, see ya. No, thank you. And then, yeah, all the treasures being filled with, um, the, the damned. And when I think the damned, I think of goblin cat lion creatures doing handstands. Is that, is that right? It's this point of the dungeon that I'm getting a little, a little nervous. Now at a quarter of my high potions, which isn't good. And I have no other good source of healing except for cottages. In some of these battles, it doesn't even seem like I can run away from them. I'm not quite clear on if that's true or bullshit, but, but no thanks. It's like, I, I want my fourth party member back. Two summoners is great, but three summoners? That's one more summoner. So we get through the object and get actually something fairly useful. Sure, something I could probably buy later with no, uh, no, no severe worries, but eh, it's free. Of course, money is no problem. There's no objects, no problem in the Fiesta. Good lord, I mean, look at these random encounters, man. They're too random. Now this guy is a bit of an uncommon enemy. Gave Beta some cool shades. Fortunately, with this party setup, I've got pretty quick ways to protect myself from just about any situation. Like, oh, you got a big powerhouse dude? Throw up an earthen wall. Uh-oh, someone's gonna cast a lot of magic and ruin your shit? Well, I got a carbuncle. Someone has a lot of HP and there's a lot of them? Whoop. Remember the Titans? Because I have multiple summoners? Yeah, I think you do. So even though this guy looks kind of big and scary and looks like he could uh, ruin your shit, in fact, the shit ruining is coming from over here. I mean, slowly coming from here, but... It'll be nice because after this dungeon, a few more summons open up that you can get. Won't have be, won't be having to be... I won't have to rely on Titan on a constant basis to get my damage out. You got, let's see, spoilers for upcoming summons. Oh. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't remember if this is one of those fights that you want to make sure you do for optional, I mean, these fights, man, uh, that you want to do for some kind of optional thing later. I know what the tower is he's referring to. It's the one where you can get holy and flare, which is of which is relevant to my interests as a Final Fantasy player in this instance, because Mystic Knight can use them both. But I'm pretty sure can't you just go to that tower even if you don't fight uh, Sackmet Sackman earlier there? I think it's true. but let's go over optional content real quick. Because while I am effectively almost done with the game, I could waltz over to X-Death if I wanted to. I'm not sure I have the level for it at the moment. But as far as I know, once you have access to transportation, you can end the game whenever you want. So in the case of an emergency, it's like August 30th. 30 days half September, April, June, yeah. 30 days half September. Assuming it's August 31st, then yeah, I could waltz over there and beat off the game real quick. But I'd be doing so with a non-optimized party. So lots of tedium was just edited out. 
You don't know what you missed. You know things are getting tedious in a dungeon when I, of all people, edit out the acquisition of treasure. It's ridiculous. Why? You missed out on such treasure as a gold hairpin, which is now on Kryal. Er, Ferris. Ferris, yeah. Gold hairpin. A Gaia hammer, which can't ever use. Probably a dark matter. I think there may have been even an elixir or two. Whew. I mean, that treasure would make anyone's butthole get a little bit soggy, but no. It's, it's gotta go. It's excess content in this case. So you, you would not believe all the falling down that was edited out earlier. It was, uh, it's pretty embarrassing, actually. Part of it was... Was, was, was my own fault. Because I got overexcited about treasure, I was not paying attention to the two whole frames, two, that the floor uh, cuts between. Two frames of content. Yikes. So lots of that was edited out. Lots of treasure required, but, but tedious treasure. Not the, not the fun kind. So that being said, I believe... We're at the end of the Great Pyramid of more or less, because I cut out a lot of it. Oh, you got fucked, Square. Yikes. I think my biggest disappointment here, though, was that there was there's no boss. There's no ultimate culmination of all the tedium. You have a weakened party lacking potions, or maybe that's why they didn't throw a boss at you right now, because you haven't had an opportunity to go to a good merchant and get good shit. I've been using ethers in this dungeon, and when you're a Final Fantasy player and you're having to use ethers, I mean, that's that's things are pretty dire. I don't recall really any situation where I wound up needing to use ethers, because they were ex usually expensive. And I'm usually per somebody who portions out their MP, saves it all for a boss situation. Then anyway, we ride the lift that's somehow in the pyramid. And now we're in the dark world, we just defeated Aghanim. And now we have to find the seven crystals. Which is going to be difficult, because they were just destroyed. Oops. And again, there's the island that's like, oh. There it was. News of that will reach the opposite side of the world in about five years. But this whole time, a PowerPoint dissolve slide was ready and it was Bahamut or Bahamut. All right, let's go over pronunciations again, because I have, you know, as a child, when you're playing these games, you kind of have it in your head to say things a certain way. They're not names or things that you hear on a regular basis, so you kind of get locked into your own way of saying it, because, let's face it, you're playing an RPG, you're by yourself. No one's there to correct you. So, we've settled the Kryle dispute. I'm, I'm okay with Kryle, by the way, airship. So let's talk, let's dish on this. Is it Bahamut, Bahamut, or Bahamut? It can't be the last one, that sounds... Sounds like a very terrible name for a dog. Here, Bahamut! And then it says rough rough, and it's like a mega flare of dog spit that comes at you. Terrible. I heard it, but I went quiet for a second thinking it would pick up again, but it didn't, and no, it's, that was just an awkward pause. It's Bahamut, kill it! Let me say it took a great deal of restraint not to make a fart sound as she emerged from the Windrake. This body is mine, but oh, so tired.
About a dollar for every time I got possessed and said that. X Death, your name is still incredibly silly. Sorry, I know it's faux pas to read RPG text boxes, but I feel like Gah! is is one that you just gotta say. Oftentimes when it's text instead of voice, there are little guttural sounds in letters that you just feel like you need to enunciate to see what the character is actually attempting to say. Oh no. Not. N not. No. Oh. The best character. Well, I guess next time Guido goes to a bank, he's gonna have his checks voided. That doesn't really make sense, does it? Lena really wants the M, C, and A to join her right now, but they're not to be found. Nah, sorry, Beatus, you're not a time mage. <laughs> you know when you're near a cat and you pet its butt and it kind of rubs its butt against you and it's weird and it's like... That's, that's what just happened, I think. So yes, there actually is a boss fight at the end of the pyramid. You just have the opportunity to cottage up if you want to, and uh... I didn't realize that, because I don't remember very uh, this very well at all. So you got the lady, she's got uh, a couple of... Snakey things, and then another helpful sensor snake there to make sure everything stays uh, stays PG-ish, PG-13-ish. I mean, come on. And then below the snake on the right, you have uh, huh? Not sure what that is. I guess he's functioning as a magic carpet of sorts. The, that's where the flight is coming from? Is it a fish man? can kind of see looks like it could be a fish at the end, or is that... Or is, oh, is that the tail of the other... the sensor snake? It's hard to tell. There's a lot going on here. And then she put a ton of product in her hair. Like, I... I don't have hair that long, but for anyone out there who does have hair that long, how much product would you need in order to make to make that work. And clearly shaved her armpit. Well, one of her armpits at least. Alright, so again, we're dealing with a gimmick boss. Who, as we're watching this, trying to figure out what to do, and in, lo and behold, it looks like one of those barrier change bosses that Final Fantasy loves so much. I know Reflect can work to your disadvantage here. I get, mm -hmm. don't remember flying off like that. I just lost my train of thought. One of those barrier change bosses, everything else heals her. I know Reflect can be a double-edged sword at times because anything she throws at you will heal her, but at the same time... You know, the party would be better alive, so, yeah. The good news is, though, I'm pretty sure with the Geomancer, I've got every element represented, so if she changes her weakness to wind, I think that branch arrow thing is, uh, and, whoa, reflect wore off very quickly. Also, beat us, come on, get your head in the game. But I think the branch arrow thing is wind elemental. I think. It may be earth. I don't know. You got Shiva for ice. You got Rama for lightning. Grease lightning. You got Ifrit for fire. For wind, you have the Geomancer's power. 
possibly, and then you got Titan for Earth. I think that's... Well, I'm missing Holy Elemental. I do have High Potions and Phoenix Towns, if that counts. Any other major elements? Any other major elements? I don't think so. But the point is, even though the boss may be somewhat of a tedious thing, it's doable. Very doable. With a party of three. Now what I wonder, and I've been wondering this about all these barrier change type bosses, what if you have one of those... One of those parties that just doesn't have any magic, or you're one of those no 750 uh, break rod things where you only get the classes that can't break rods. Then, do you have items you can use that dish elemental damage? Because as far as I know, as far as I know, it's... They tend to negate physical attacks, do they not? I'm pretty sure, because I know I've asked this before in one of the previous 776 parts of this that I've been uploading so far, but... What happens? How does one go about beating off these these barrier change bosses if one does not have barrier breaking attacks? I do wonder. As far as I can tell, as long as you have Reflect up, this boss pretty much can't do anything to you. And there we go, we got either Wind or Earth, I think that's Wind. Or maybe not. Unfortunately with Mystic Knight, you don't have any Wind, I don't think. Though I didn't try it in this fight, but I'm wondering if maybe Poison would work. Anyway. Wouldn't that be nice? Poison. It's poison. Is poison its own elemental thing? I think it's considered an element because you can be weak to poison, so therefore it has to be an element. Look, Final Fantasy logic and real world logic just don't collide. You have to think outside the box. Sorry your family got voided. Luna. Sorry everybody's fucking dead. And that is pretty much that. We now have access to the airship, so effectively, we're set. So look forward to that. And a just quick preview, we're rearranging the party. Can't have two Geomancers. The summon party's back. So next time, we are gonna go on a little bit of a summon errand. Errand. And we're gonna power up these summoners and make them deadly as shit. Also on the agenda, pick up, if, uh, with the tablet we've now acquired, can pick up a few super weapons. Well, maybe super weapons, I don't know if they're considered super. We got super weapons, we got a few summons to get. And, um, yeah, and a couple of elements to get. We got Holy and Flare to get. So summons, Holy Flare, possibly another tablet in there. So look forward to all that.